troubleshooting tips. Here are a few tips on solving common alarm conditions. If you obtain an air inline alarm, press the run pause to pause the pump. Press yes enter to resume. You'll be taken to the run to start screen. Disconnect the line from the patient. Press the prime bolus key to prime the air through the pumping mechanism and remove all air from the line. Press yes enter to exit the prime function and return to the run screen. Press the run pause key to restart the infusion. If the pump is not in use, it should be plugged in at least once every two weeks for a few minutes in order to keep the internal nickel metal hydride battery charged. There's no need to turn the pump on if it's plugged in for charging. Error code 33 warns the user that the internal battery needs to be recharged. Plug the pump in for a few minutes and restart. Keeping the pump paused for two minutes will result in a warning alert on the screen reading, Alarm Unattended. This informs the user that the pump is not yet running. Please press the pause key to clear the alarm and continue as directed on the screen. Replace set three alarms typically indicate a need for a new administration set. Replace set four alarms are caused by excessive over or under pressurization of the set. Reposition the IV bags to release pressure on the bag. Check for clamps and release any excessive pressure placed on the set. If troubleshooting measures are not effective, consider contacting clinical support for assistance or send the pump in for service.